Hey everyone, this is Lucky70X, and welcome back to Let's Play Mario & Luigi's Superstar Saga! In the last episode, uh, a villain whose name is Cacletta, who never said whose name it is, but it's Cacletta, uh, kidnapped Princess Peach's voice, because kidnapping Princess Peach is so out of style. So we're gonna go rescue her. Yes, yeah, lesson I'm probably gonna do the introduction for a while, because now I'm gonna start getting random battles, and I'm just gonna do bulk recording and save myself the trouble. Anyway, this guy's taken out through a brick barrel or something like that. But he's gonna teach us about how to fight as a team. But I'm not gonna do that because he's gonna teach us how to do that in two seconds anyway. So I don't get why he has to do that tutorial because he's gonna make you do it right here anyway. And inside the barrel's a Goomba. Yeah, of course the first enemy you avoid is gonna be a Goomba. How typical. Um, these enemies. Uh, I'll explain the enemies in a second, but uh, they're gonna just quickly explain how to fight now. Um, basically it's the same as before, except now that we have Luigi, all of Mario, uh, all of Luigi's at at uh, attacks and dodges uh, use the B button. So Mario's A, Luigi's B. Just think that Luigi's the second banana, so he gets B. But so I don't know, something like that. Anyway, um, so as you can also see, if you time uh, your dodges right, you can actually do counterattacks as well, which is very nice because you can do damage during their turns as well then. So basically this game's all about like you know learning your opponent's uh, patterns and learning how to attack them when it's their turn and how to dodge their attacks. Which is kind of cool because it makes it for more of an action style RPG. Now Goombas, as you can see they're pretty easy, they only have like 4 HP, and you can kill them pretty effortlessly. Um, they're pretty easy to see who's attacking. Uh, they pretty much go right in front of their brother attacking as well, so they're really easy to dodge and or counter attack. So don't worry about that. Um, yeah, we're, uh, we're gonna have another tutorial here. Um, the ship hit the ship still tutor tutorial kind of stuff. So once we get the ship, we'll be done with all that crap and we can move on. Well, kinda. Anyway, this guy has having trouble catching a Goomba because he's stupid. So he's gonna teach us how to enter battle. That's right. You actually uh. If you played Paper Mario before, or I'm not sure, did they have this in Mario RPG? I don't think they did. Um, if you jump on an enemy as you enter battle, you do damage to them. But if they hit, if an enemy hits the bro behind instead, uh, it'll actually do um, knock that bro out for. It'll stun. It'll stun that bro. So if he's attacked before it's his turn, you won't be able to dodge. So be careful when you're doing that. But if you can do that, as you can see, you can kill those Goombas really fast. And hey, we gotta level up! So let's explain level ups. Um, as you can see, you get a bunch of stats all across the board. And then you also get the option to add a stat into any one as a bonus. We're gonna do power for Mario, because power to Mario. It's not an LP here. I think so. Hey, two! I can go with that. I am fine with that. Uh, as, you, as I said before, I'm gonna go with HP, power, and bro points for the most part. Well, mostly HP, power, and maybe some defense and stash. I don't know. We'll see. I'll just do it at a whim. Anyway, so we have to get this other guy. I'm not even gonna cut this battle because if you do a first attack like this, it's so quick. Ready? Bam. Bam. And Luigi stomp. And Luigi's gonna get his level now, so there we go, level two. Isn't that exciting? Taking our first steps into the unknown. Um, let's give him some HP because I want him to be our tank and eh, I don't like this. Um, basically what happens is, ooh, we got the two. I'm happy with that. What happens is, um, the more you diversify your roulette picks, the more you, uh, the more the higher the roulette bonus will be. So in other words, don't only do power, don't only do HP. You actually want to diversify it and you know alternate between the two, or at least if not alternate between more of them, because then you'll start getting you know four extra points per level instead of one. Uh, save point, not gonna even bother. I don't need to save. I'm better than that. All right, so we're gonna activate this crane and move on. It took me three tries to hit the stupid crane. Ay ay ay. So we need to then lift up the barrels and move on. Go for the barrels, Luigi's cheering it on. Um, that's not a barrel! That's not a barrel! That's Luigi! I mean, I know he has the intelligence of a barrel, but no, I'm just kidding. Man, I'm just gonna insult Mario and Luigi this entire game, aren't I? And <laughs> that looks uncomfortable, you think? He's getting freaking wedgied there, look at that. That cannot be comfortable. And yet he is. You, somehow that's an efficient lookout. A guy hanging, you know, a few feet above you with binoculars, and that's a really weird expression. What's if all the hoopla? Holy crap! We're being attacked. Luigi, stop! I know it's a late of that, but whatever. Boss looks so weird in this game. Anyway, here we go, Cacletto, for a really weird, giant freaking mouth like a Goron from uh, the Oracle series. Um, she has such a great laugh though. Anyway, so, uh, Fawful's gonna attack the ship because he's the coolest sidekick ever, and yeah, that's basic stuff. I love this guy's attacks. 
I'm here laughing at you. You give us chase the You are the idiots of foolishness. <laughs> okay, I love I love this might be one of my favorite lines in the entire game. Princess Peach's sweet voice will soon be the bread that makes a sandwich of Cacletta's desires. And this battle shall be the delicious mustard of that bread. The mustard of your doom. The mustard of your doom, really? You are the craziest guy. Bowser, no! He killed Bowser. He's dead. He's dead. How the hell did you get behind us? Alright, Mr. Mustard Guy, we're gonna kick your butt. Alright, this is still basic stuff. Um, there's actually gonna still be more tutorial stuff in here. Uh, basically, you just jump on and stomp on him, as usual. Now, um, in order to dodge his attacks, you have to pay attention to the color of the words that he says, because that'll be the first Brokey attacks. Um, you know, I haven't explained this either. Uh, we have the item option now, and items, uh, mushrooms recover HP, and 1-up mushrooms recover, uh, well, it revives you if you get, uh, KO'd, if you get, you know, zero health. So keep that in mind, and we'll just kill Fawful. This one's pretty easy. And here's the tutorial part. Bowser's basically just gonna tell us, uh, how to dodge this guy's attacks by paying attention to the colors. And it's basically just a hint, you know, always pay attention to enemies, because they always have some sort of tell as to who they're going to attack and how they're going to attack. So always pay attention to them, that's the key to Mario and Luigi fighting. See Red? He's going to get of this. Uh, if he says, have you readiness for this? He will attack both bros, but he'll attack the one whose color it is first. Man, that's complicated to say. Okay, I guess he, it's always Red? I don't know, I haven't seen him do a blue readiness yet. Whatever, let's just kill him. He dead yet? Okay, he lost his headgear. Now he's just, uh, walking on the ground. So let's jump on this bean face. Boink! Don't roll into me. That's not cool. Boink! Kabonk. Oh, going for Luigi, huh? Well, too bad. He, he's a Mario Brothers 2. He can jump on your face. Jump on your face! And there we go, he's done. Well, he's not dead, but... Because, you know, you can't kill the psychic in the first... In the tutorial battles. But... He is gonna go ahead and wipe us out now. He has fury. I love that line. I have fury. <laughs> I, I didn't even read what I said, but it says something about foul-smelling roses. And oh god, Fawful, you have the greatest lines ever. You can tell I'm a Fawful fanboy. And he's destroying the ship. He's destroying the ship. Oh god, abandoned ship. Uh, that can't be good. Well, we all died. Huh? What? Okay, so Mario and Luigi are plumbing into the Earth and collide into solid rock. They should be dead. But I guess they wouldn't be super then, would they? Alright, so now we're in the Borderland. As in, we're not quite in uh, Bean Bean Kingdom yet, but... Uh, where's Mario? Where's Mario? Oh, there he is! Let's pull him out. Go, Luigi, you're so strong. And you're also the butt of every joke. Mario's just standing on his head like the psychopath he is. So Mario's a psychopath, and uh... Okay, I actually want to show this off. You can't actually go anywhere if the bro can't make it right behind you, so... You'll be stuck if you can't get both bros up there. Excellent! Let's move on! Bowser from the other side. Look at all the Koopas, they're all dead. Look at- there's like an excru excruciating pain here. And Mario and Luigi just keep moving on. Oh, you guys don't care about the turtles. Peta's gonna be all up on you. Anyway, so we're at the border, and in order to do, uh, in order to cross the border illegally, we have to do the border jump. I mean, border hopping. It's such a pun on illegal immigration. I'm not sure whether to find that funny or scary. Anyway, let's do it. What you have to do is basically you just have to hop over the border, literally. Um, obviously, A controls Mario, B controls Luigi as usual. Uh, the flag in the background will tell you how much, uh, Oh crap. How, uh, how long do you have to go? This sh this sh we shouldn't have any problem with this. Um, oh, I jumped too early. Damn you and your trickiness. Um, and then the lives, obviously, you can only get three hits with each bro, or you lose, and you don't want to lose this, because that'd be shameful. How can you lose to hammer bros? Hey, hey now. Hey now. And that should be it. There we go, not bad. Alright, so we have now hopped over the border, and we are now in Bean Bean Kingdom. Hooray! Let's go on. Hold up! 
what do you want? We beat your stupid game. We crossed illegally. And apparently we're the first ones to ever jump over our border successfully, which is kind of weird, but we get a map for it. So let's check out that map. It's down here. And, well, as you can see, you can toggle the names on and off, but this map doesn't really tell us much. In fact, it's kind of a useless map overall. Whatever, okay. Thanks for that, I don't really care. Let's go back in here, though, because there's actually something we can do. You can actually play this game again, except make it harder, and you get a reward for it. So we're going to go ahead and do that. I mean, I, you can go all the way up to, like, really high levels, but I'm only going to do this once, I think. Oh, how did I make that? Oh, don't think you can fool me. Because I don't like this game that much, actually. I'm not that good at it. I... no. I think not. Oh god, oh god, oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, oh, I did not think he was going to go for Luigi. Jerk! Come on, you can't fool me. Don't think you can fool a Mario, bro. There we go, we actually <laughs> didn't get hit by Mario at all, but we survived if Luigi. Those fireworks don't really mean anything, they won't give you more reward. Um, so we could keep going this and keep going to harder and harder levels, but I'm only going to do this once and show you the reward you get, which is... Beans! You get beans for reward. I mean, we're in Bean Bean King, what do you expect? So you get two beans, congratulations. Uh, there's four types of beans in the game, let's actually show those off. Um, press R, you can get your beans, here we go. These are he beans, I don't even know what that means. Um, but basically they're kind of your, the, the, the beans you get from, uh, mini games. There's beans you get from enemies, beans you find underground, beans you get from something else I can't remember off the top of my head, and beans you get from mini games. Now, we're gonna need to use those later to do a few things, mostly extra stuff, so, uh, we'll keep that in mind, and this mini games later in the game you can get the he beans for, so I'm not gonna bother with the border jump anymore. Let's move onward. Alright, so, and we have to jump over these spikes, basically you just have to alternate A and B quickly. If you land on it, you get knocked back, so be careful of that. And hey, it's a mushroom! Good for that. Yeah, that's not very hard to do, and it's another mushroom. We don't need more mushrooms, we have like seven of them already, my god. Okay, fine, we like mushrooms. And hey, it's a new enemy, so let's go fight it. Did I not get the first strike there? Oh, that's stupid. Whatever, these are fighter flies. Really, they're just pretty easy. I mean, basics. Oh my god, I can't believe I got hit there. Yeah, they're a little slower to time, but once you use the timing, they're really easy. This should kill him. And this should keep an attacking him. As you can see, Mario has a bit more power, though, and Luigi has a bit more HP, so... Not anything to worry about. They're pretty easy. Um, see, so yeah, I won't show them anymore. Although, I'm going to be using these guys for a couple things later. We can't actually do anything over here, so we're going to head this way. Hey, and we're back. Alright, so, uh, let's head up here. That seems like the appropriate option, and what the heck? Is that Bowser? And, of course, Mario, with his traditional hello of jumping on his butt, um, yeah, he's strapped in a cannon. Oh, Mario, you just like to jump on people. What the hell is that thing? I love his laugh. Nyak, 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 nyak. It's like one of the... Which one of the three suits just had that laugh? If I'm right. I love Bowser's angry face. Tollstar. That's the lamest name I've ever heard. Tollstar. Oh my god. Anyway, so this guy's a greedy jerk, and he's gonna make us uh, pay all of our coins in order to get him out. And Mario, being the nice guy he is, but when he's not jumping on people's butts, gives him all our coins. My coins, no. Oh, shut up. Yeah, apparently, a uh, little less in the economics here. Apparently, the exchange rate sucks, so we can get more coins. That's right, we need a hundred more coins. Oh boy. Well, let's go ahead and do that. How fun is that gonna be? Um, so the first option is to head up here. Um, I think. Whoa, hi. Don't wanna fight you. I want this thing here though. Give, it, give me, give me, give me, thank you. And we'll get some coins from this thing. Oh, damn it! Come on. Come on, 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 come on. Hey, we got a lot of coins from that one. Hey, look at that, we're already at 17. Man, this is gonna take forever. But we can't get half these question boxes. Well, what we're gonna actually have to do is, hey, more coins. Um, we're gonna be learning some new stuff soon. Hooray, new stuff. I love new stuff. New stuff makes me happy. So do mushrooms. Mushrooms make me happy too. Get out of the way, I don't wanna fight you. Um, well, we can actually have here as well. I forgot how big this place is. Alright, these things just alternate A and B. 
and you'll get across, also hold in left as well, so you can keep going. And yeah, we'll make our way back here to get some of these question boxes later. Because we want coins, coins are good. Coins make me happy. There we go. Actually, we're not gonna actually, like, reach a real shop until a few... I don't know what you'd call it, like, levels or areas or whatnot, but we're actually... Well, surprisingly, you don't get hit a shop for a long time in this game. But shops are cool. Syrup! Okay, syrup's a new item. Uh, syrup, let's go look at our items. Will recover 20 bros points, and soon we're gonna actually have a use for those, so... Actually, well, almost pretty much right now.